Hello and welcome to this tutorial. Uh, it's about how to add features and code to uh, your mock Atui. Mm, I make this tutorial because uh, the user Fefusho on uh, the subreddit mock Atui asked how uh, can we ha can he add mm, features to his game. So what do I mean when I say features? Like I think we you need context. For example, you are playing uh, Formula Cartoui or OPT Pact or anything, and uh, you really like one thing about the game, mm, a feature. For example, wow, uh, I really like. Uh, uh, I can have the blue shell uh, behind me, uh, the the thunder cloud. Uh, let's. Mm, I. Became a, I become a giant with the thundercloud. I can have a bullet bill and still have a, another item, etc. I'm talking about this. So how can you do it? Well, uh, the word features is not really that. It's simple. It's just a code, like a gecko code or a action replay code. That's all. So today you will uh, learn how to add it to your game uh, forever. Like not uh, okay. I had uh, I had um, the the code to my game. Uh, I can uh, deactivate. No, no. Okay. So what you need? First, you need Dolphin, the Wii emulator. Then, uh, uh, um, take the beta version, like uh, the latest. Because uh, this table uh, haven't had uh, any updates for five years, so that's not really interesting. Then um, you need a copy of a Mario Kart Wii. It's I hope you can have it uh, yourself. I can't uh, give you because of legal reason, but maybe there is in the description a link to Mario Kart Wii in. Uh, WBFS format, it's like ISO but uh, twice as small, way much lighter. Um, then you need SZS uh, WIMS SZS toolset in description. Uh, take uh, this one, the latest for Windows, right here, CWIN 64. Mm, and uh, with WIMS ISO tools and with these four things we can start uh, making uh, the tutorial so when you have everything uh, open the game uh, open Dolphin and we will extract the file of Mocha Go to configure um, the past. You, you need to you don't need to open the game. You need to have it uh, list uh, to have it in the list of Dolphin. So I will add uh, my uh, download uh, 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 okay. <laughs> so uh, download the uh, dialect tool. Selection A. Okay. Now I have the game. Um, I will take the same one as you. Mario Kart Wii dot uh, WBFS. You can do it with uh, an ISO. It's exactly the same thing. Don't worry. Okay. So, um, right click. Property. Uh, system. Now, you right click on disk. Not partition, disk. Mm, extract uh, the disk well, whenever you want, maybe like here. Mario Kart Wii. Hop. Now the game will be extract. Easy.
Okay, so now you have the game, but not like an ISO, like a file. You have all the file of the game. Okay, 99, please. Okay, now that's good. So, now that the game is extract, it's still really easy. So you have SZS toolset and width. Now uh, you need to make a GCT file. What is a GCT file? It's a file with Gecko code. That's really easy. So, link, wait here. Uh, oh, no, I have this. It's, you can make a GCT file online. All you need to do is write uh, the code. So, game ID. Mm, for more cartridges, AOMCU01. Mm. Yes, this one. For if you are in North America, it's AMCE01. Uh, if you are in um, in Europe, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Wait. P1 maybe? Yes, for PAL. Okay. AOMC P01. If you are uh, in, in Europe. Uh, the game I uh, give in the description is NTSU. So, North America. Okay, so now you have the game. You, we will create our code. So, there is the game ID and write the code. I have already uh, a lot of code because uh, I'm uh, working on a custom track distribution. It will be released someday, I don't know. Mm, so we'll take faster menu navigation because uh, it's really easy to see if it's work or it doesn't. So I have the code, I take it. Now I write it here. Oh, this is the code. And the title, or whatever you like, just a way so you can uh, know exactly what the code is. So I will write faster menu. Add code. That's one. Now I will take one from, from Formula Cart. Formula Cart, there is. Um, I know, I know. Right here. Okay. Hide, drift, um, no background. There isn't uh, all the item color. Mm, strange. Mm. Oh, here. All item can land. So every item can be on the ground. Like uh, if uh, you are, if there is a shock, and you have a bullet bill but you didn't use it, it will be on the ground instead of uh, losing it forever. So I will take this one because it's really fun. So NTSCU because I have an American version. I take it. Now I write it. All item land. Add code. And I think I will stop. I two code is already uh, enough. Maybe, maybe I can take uh, last one. Yeah, the pretty speedometer. So we have a speedometer on the screen. And TSCU again. Like this copy. Mm, where is it? 
right here. Okay, and speedometer. So, okay, I will stop. I have three code. The, f the idea of the game, I will download the GCT file. Now I have it. So what do I need to do? Uh, go to your uh, data sys uh, file no di directory. Mm, take the RMC E01. You don't have to uh, put it here, but uh, for simplicity, I will do this. Okay. So to add code to your game, to add features, you need to patch the main point all. It's inside the main point all that there is the code. Now, thanks to uh, these two things that we download earlier, uh, for which uh, download the latest version for uh, Windows, if you are on Windows, Windows, SciWin64. Okay, so now we need to do a command. So, hold shift and right click and you will have uh, open the PowerShell window here. If you don't, that's not a problem. You can do it uh, on Windows, but you will need to navigate to your um, with your uh, PowerShell or your time. So it's way more difficult, I think. Um, but you can do it. For example, I will do that. Up, cd do that, cd do that. Okay. Now if I do this, cd up. Location not. Uh, but I don't know to change the disk. Mm. Well. Anyway. <laughs> Okay, so hold shift, right click, open PowerShell window here. Now you have this. And with the command I give you in uh, the description, the command is uh, wstrt patch main point all, blah blah blah, add section, uh, hop, I will take this one. Hop, et voilà. Okay, I will just change the path because that's not a good one. Okay, main point all. Main point all. New. Okay, we'll do this. Um, this way, this will be way more show about what uh, we do. Create a new folder and name it new. So, the version patch will be inside the new uh, folder and it will not replace the old one in case uh, you have a code that breaks your game you can come back with uh, another version okay so I have this uh, command now enter cannot file new point main point all. yes that's my fault I don't need to it's not here it's right here new slash oh okay save patch file to doll new main okay now see i go inside the new folder i have a main point all so like you can do uh, old old folder i always do this main up in the new you put it inside this i always do this in case uh, something don't work trust me it's uh, very common for example i uh, show you my mod this like I have uh, all this main point all in case something don't work. The same with uh, low code because I use low code. I have a lot of low code. Just in case. We don't know. Okay. Um, download. More cat. We. Data. This. Now. Uh, the new is now inside this. And you can launch your game and test if everything works if it doesn't propose you uh, do right click property uh, open with uh, modify and uh, you you go uh, and you do it with dolphin okay let's test if it worked
because you can uh, change uh, the file of your game and test uh, right away. You don't have to uh, make a new ISO or anything. That's really cool. Okay, so wait. Okay, that's good. Mm, sorry, the oh, okay, so it didn't work, but I know why. Oh. You need, uh, you need to deactivate um, the c activate the cheat. You need to deactivate it because it will um, be in conflict with your inside code. Your uh, everything you put yourself, okay? Now it's deactivated. Close, and I will open main point all again. So I have menu, faster navigation, and speedometer, and the all item can run. Is it working? You can see that it's way more faster. So yes, it, yes, it's working. Okay, let's see. There is a speedometer. And yes, there is. Okay. Now your game have all the code you wanted. So you need to uh, not extract, um, but um, I don't know how to say it. But rebuild your game. That's easy. No problem. Up. Let's just. Okay. Now you go inside. Uh, right here, in the Mario Kart Wii, where uh, there is data. Now, hold shift, right click. Open PowerShell window here. So, thanks to uh, command there is in the description, you can do this. So what is the command? It's with uh, Wim's IDO tools, this one. Okay, now you have the choice. I will uh, rebuild my game with WBFS. If you want, you can put ISO. Why I use WBFS? It's because it's twice as small. If you want an example, right here. Th this is the same game, exactly the same game. And ISO is 4.5 uh, GB. And WBFS is 2 Point seven gigabytes. So I will do it with WBFS. But you can do it with ISO. A new file name. It's the name of the game. Uh, whatever. Tutorial uh, features. Wow. The A wasn't there. Okay. And the folder name. It's data. Because uh, you did it where. Uh, there was the data folder. Don't worry. Fin, don't forget about this. Alt Shift, right click. Where there is data. Now let's enter. Oh. Uh, this will take a little moment. Except if, oh, did I miss? Okay. This will take a little moment because uh, the game need to rebuild everything to have. Uh, a single file okay it's been l almost 20 min minutes that's okay I'm sorry if uh, my English isn't uh, that good mm, I'm fluent I can say I'm fluent I have uh, some problem with pronunciation of uh, some word, but uh, I think this is understandable. Okay, I have the game tutorial feature dot WBFS. 
Let's test it. Oh, dolphin. Okay. Well, congratulations, you made it. You have now a game with everything you wanted. Well, that's it. I think that's it. So, let's just try uh, the speedometer. You can see, yes, it works. Oh, what? Okay, anyway, and that's it. That's it. So, thank you for watching. Thank you for your attention. I hope this was uh, really understandable. Uh, if you have any question, don't uh, don't hesitate and ask uh, in the comment section. I will answer everything because, well, mm, modding Mario Kart Wii is not easy, and uh, for myself it was a lot of uh, research, training, and uh, I, if there was one person that could help me, uh, that would have been really really faster so if i can help everyone uh, to mod more country mod more easily i will thank you for watching and see you next time